What do the fans want to know? What do they want to know? How does he feel about cuckolding? Does Arabelle bring you to on set? How many times do you have sex in a day? Your boobs have become very loose. I think that was for me. <laughs> Hello. Um, you guys are nosy and always ask me questions about my relationships <laughs> and boyfriends and all things. So I thought, who better to answer than Arabelle's boyfriend? Hi, I'm boyfriend. Boyfriend. <laughs> I'm kind of excited. Right? Yeah, I want to see what's up. Okay. What do the fans want to know? What do they want to know? So, um, do you have to ask for Roadhead or does she just know when? She just knows when. And when is when we're in a car. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, maybe you have a lot of Roadhead. <laughs> I mean, is it a road trip without some Roadhead? Also, it's important for everyone to know that she's learning how to drive now so that I can reciprocate Roadhead <laughs> as well. Roadhead goes both ways. Goes the rules of the road. <laughs> He who driveth cometh. <laughs> We're super safe. Uh, <laughs> do you ever color in her tattoos? I have not, and I will. I absolutely will. I have a couple of tattoos of my own that get color filled by myself sometimes, and uh, kind of filled. yeah, they get filled. <laughs> the cat. You happy? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but yeah, I think we should carry some magic markers next to the bed, and that would be actually fun, and she would be upset with me every time. <laughs> How does he feel about cuckolding? No, hey, I'm one of them. Personally, not a fan. Yeah, <laughs> that's it actually. Personally, not a fan. <laughs> Is Arabelle a go out and rip it up or a stay home and snuggle type of girlfriend? Perfect combination of both. She can freaking hang for a four day non-stop shebangy bangy or we can just sit at home and watch a bunch of dumb television and cuddle and eat a ton of Thai food like we did today. Versatile. <laughs> is seeing your girlfriend with other people just part of the job or do you actively enjoy it? I don't. I don't watch her work at all. I have no interest in it. I was lucky enough, I guess, to not know anything. <laughs> lucky enough? Well, I mean, like, like, it didn't color any of my... I didn't have any... Yeah, we just met and organically and fell in love. She's soft like marshmallow. She's much softer than marshmallow. She's like a freaking cloud. Literally every time I hold her, I'm like, how is this even possible? Your skin is not human skin. It's too much. It's too soft. It's the softest thing in the world. Okay. <laughs> Does Arabelle fart or snot? That's the two options. Out of those two, fart. Hey man, we're all human. <laughs> But who's not? I don't know. I don't know what that means. I think, yeah, I don't know. Does she like to get foot massages? Yes, she would like to get any massages at any time, always. Maybe butt massages about foot massage, but foot massage is up there. Yeah. Does Arabelle bring you to on set? I mean, I dropped her off once, but no, we try to kind of keep that stuff separate. Which is Arabelle's oldest tattoo and which one is her favorite? Oldest tattoo is covered up. Correct. Do you know which one it is? Uh, give me a second. I'll think about it. What the <laughs> fuck? Oh, yeah. It's, it was words. It said... Oh, you don't have to tell them. <laughs> I won't tell you, but it's yes, really but stupid. it's covered up. Her favorite tattoo is John Normal's back piece. I know, because I asked. <laughs> <laughs> Will you get a tattoo with Arabelle's name or likeness anywhere? I will not. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, I would not either. I think, you know. I would get a you, tattoo with you. Uh, yeah, but I wouldn't absolutely. get of. Can you imagine you're fucking somebody and they're seeing their own face on you? I know someone. That's weird. It's weird. I did know someone that got their their wife tattooed to them and then they broke up. So they definitely have their ex. Is it like where? Tattooed on the, I can't, I think on their arm. At least it's not chest, so like every future girlfriend has to like... <laughs> just stare. Yeah, just like, oh my God. I mean, I have like a really stupid tattoo pretty close to my fucking, you know, there's many complaints about it staring, at, you know. Oh, I'm yeah. done, I'm, don't mind. I mean, you are the one who I'm referring to with the complaints. We <laughs> first started know? dating. <laughs> Like, I have to look at this stupid face. So, like, imagine that was an ex. Horrendous. Or even yourself. Imagine. <laughs> imagine. I don't want to look at myself. Ugh. What was your first date together? Our first official date was during a lunar eclipse. But we couldn't wait for that date on, on a rooftop. Because we, we spoke on uh, through text for, like, a while. And we were, like, I was fully enamored. And I couldn't wait any longer. 
And so a few days before our date, she was in my neighborhood on a date with somebody else. And I was like, you're in my neighborhood and you're not calling me? What's up? She ditched him and that was our first date. <laughs> Sorry. Uh <laughs> if you're a fan, thank you, and I'm sorry. <laughs> How many times do you have sex in one day, in a day? In a good day, a lot. On a bad day, not at all. That's how I, you know, differentiate between good days and bad days. <laughs> we have sex. Yeah. <laughs> but usually if we start, we don't stop. How did we meet? Bumble. Bumble. Yeah, straight bumble. Straight bumble. Mm -hmm. It's true. Your boobs have become very loose. I think that was for me. <laughs> I don't know where and when you have seen them, but I've noticed it and I've been doing sit ups and no, not sit ups, the other one push ups. And yeah, hopefully, you know, in the future, you'll like my boobs. <laughs> Is she dominant or submissive? Both. Classic switch. You're a lucky man, so treat her like the wonderful person she is. I am a lucky man, and I treat her like the average human being that she is. <laughs> Ew. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. No, you're right. What? Can I give you Arabelle's what? Can, I give, can you give me Arabelle? Give? Yeah, since you owe me. I mean, send a FedEx shipping label, and maybe, but I'm not paying shipping. Favorite moment? <laughs> Or a thing you've seen her do? No, it's private. Oh. <laughs> yeah, it's private. <laughs> Fair. You'll have to tell me later. I will. You know what it is. Uh, how is it knowing your girl is a throat demon and will suck your soul out? I feel like kind of like being, I feel like I'm Ronald Reagan. <laughs> what? Yeah, because Nancy Reagan. Oh! Yeah. I'm like, how would Ronald Reagan feel? And I'll tell you how. Presidential. That's how. <laughs> that's what it feels like knowing that your girlfriend is a throat demon. Goddamn presidential. <laughs> Do you like her lips or her lips more? I feel like it's insane. What? They're both amazing. I have to choose. I mean, I guess you don't I'm, have to. I would say Arabelle is like the best kisser ever, but also her nipples are also the best kissers ever. So. <laughs> Any favorite uh, musical? F oh my god, I can't talk. Do y'all have any musical favorite bands or movies? Yeah, we like a lot of music. That's how we bonded, um, and we listen to honestly such a wide breadth of stuff. That it's kind of hard to decide on a couple of favorites. Yeah, we're just generally really, really into music. <laughs> yeah, of all kinds. Uh, Arabel doesn't like musicals though. So when it comes to musical <laughs> movies. <laughs> don't like musicals as a genre kind of like ugh, but there are musicals that i do enjoy what's kind of like favorite bands that we both like what's our faves what do we listen to all the time we both like francois hardy yeah we do a lot of that i don't know yeah we listen to a lot of different stuff yeah i feel like we've listened to a lot of shangri-las together that's also true i do love shangri-las and all sorts of old, old funk stuff also yeah i don't <sighs> like We've mostly just gone to metal shows. That's true. We went but to that's also them. like what I go see live most of the time in general. I mean, everything else is bullshit. It's metal is life. That's not actually true. I don't know. Whatever. We like a lot of music. Yeah. Of true. all the kinds. Do we have morning s In good mornings, yes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no question. Just wanted to say it's awesome you two found each other and that y'all are happy. We are happy and thank you. Um, are you scared, bro? I would be scared. Are you scared, bro? I'd be scared. I was. Scared? Yeah. Hmm. I was excited. Yeah. yeah. Now he's like dreading no, it. Now, now I'm scared, yeah. <laughs> now he's scared. No, but I, I'm, I was excited. She was like, it was so fun to talk to her. And like, generally, I'm such a weirdo and finding anybody who's like, makes me feel less alone in the universe is hard, you know? And like, even at first meetings and stuff, was, uh, before we even met, when we just texted and stuff, I was like, oh, really hope she doesn't just bail because I think we'll get along. <laughs> Does Arabelle let you hook up with other women? It's not a question of let, I really don't want to. Um, uh, quel I don't know if that's me or you, but whatever. Um, 30, How old are you? Actually, wait, 35, 34, 35, 35? 34. So I'm 35, 35. Yeah. <laughs> oh, what's it like dating a star? It's like dating any other person, but you see her friends more in the house. <laughs> That's very accurate. <laughs> yeah.
<laughs> it's exactly the same elsewhere, but there's a lot more please hold the camera and then flashing. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's Number one difference. Oh, and free shots. And free oh, free yeah. Shots. Do we get free shots? Because she has fans. Did she suck very well? This is someone's second language. Uh, did she suck very well? Yeah. Did I suck very well? Yes, you Yes, you did suck very well. <laughs> I'm good. I hope one day you would have sucked very well again. <laughs> <laughs> How did he get so lucky to have come across you? Literally lucky. So straight luck. 100% luck. No plans. <laughs> <laughs> no plans. <laughs> How would you pamper the missus? I like that I'm the missus. Um, after she has a tough day. Fetal position. <laughs> cradling. cradling. Yeah, I she do needs, like she needs a long cradle. I need a long cradle. And then we order a ton of food. Yeah. Cradling, like real dumb television. Lots of blankets, dogs and cats, food, Chinese probably. And yeah, and housewives. Yeah. Until she falls asleep. <laughs> like, this yeah, so it's like, <laughs> like a dog on her one side and I'm on the other, I guess. What's your favorite thing about Arabelle? I don't know. Favorite thing? I don't know. I don't like all these like comparison things. Or like we have to choose one. Yeah, I it's have crazy. a lot of the hardest time when people are just like, what's your favorite band? I'm like, I have no idea. I'm Polly Amorous. <laughs> <laughs> when it comes uh, to bands. Polly Benderous. <laughs> yeah. It's fully true. Like, what's your favorite thing about me? That's crazy. About you? Yeah. Okay, I can say like top three. Dude, give me top three. Okay, you're very kind. You're smart. And you're really stupid. <laughs> <laughs> you're witty. You make it... me laugh. Hey. 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 <laughs> yeah, you can pick three. Mm, I would say you're also astoundingly kind and very considerate and like very inclusive and welcoming into all parts of your, like, your life and stuff, which I find awesome. And then you have hot takes on things, which is fun. <laughs> you should do a TV show, Arabelle's Hot Takes. Hot Takes. Yeah, Arabelle's Hot Takes. Over rough. Really? You don't like it? <laughs> I would just be a monster. Yeah, <laughs> but they, they have to be limited to like 18 seconds. And this has been a hot take, you know, I'll just say some <laughs> and fuck it. It's great. That was too Oh, sorry, sorry. sorry. <laughs> I like, I like cooking for you. <laughs> that is not something you like about me. I like the way you eat stuff. It's hot. It's hot. You're cool. <laughs> uh, oh my God. You know what I like about Arabelle? I like Arabelle reading me poetry. She's romantic as hell. Very romantic. And I think that's amazing too. And also when she cares about you, she makes sure that you know that she cares about you. She shows it in many different ways. And I think that's a beautiful quality. Mm. <laughs> she good in bed. Is or just she good in bed, period? Kai, good is sh she in bed? Oh, bed and good she is. What's her snack of choice? Uh, Parmesan, like parm crisps, That's number okay. one. And honestly, honestly, if we're going straight snacking and like we're not like limiting ourselves to like the things that are in the snack aisle, just a serious block of cheese. Yeah, a full yeah. wheel. <laughs> it's like yeah. a little mouse. It's crazy. Do you like to watch her suck? Do you ever masturbate to her scenes? No, I like to watch her suck my How does he handle jealousy? Out of sight, out of mind. That's it, really? I think so. <laughs> I don't, I'm not, I don't get jealous about the, the porn stuff. It's work, uh, it feels like work. One of the best things she's done, you've done when we started dating. At first, she first asked me like, yo, is this gonna be a fucking problem? And I was like, look, I don't fucking know. Like, yeah. never dealt with this before. No idea how I would feel. At the moment, I don't feel like there's any problem. She was like, well, whenever there's a problem, just freaking talk to me. And I thought that was awesome. And then we went to like a, like a work a convention type situation. When we got there, I was like, oh, this is just a regular convention. This is a convention. It feels like a normal convention of an industry, people doing industry stuff. And like that immediately just put it in my head as like, this is just work. Does he like your tattoos? Almost all of them. Yeah, almost. Whatever. Yeah? Don't hate. No, don't tell me. Don't hate. Also, is it gone already? Which one? It's almost gone. Well, it's not that one. We're, we're, we're in a fan of the vagina no, I, don't, I don't think it was, you know, that beautiful, but whatever. It's almost gone. I know. The cover up has, has started. I feel like since you're deleting it, it's like a full free to talk shit. 
Now you can, can talk shit. You have a bunch of shitty fuck tattoos. All of my tattoos are hideous except... Mm, yeah, I like some of the hideous ones. So. I think the cat mermaids are cool. I love Both the cat. Cool. I love the cat mermaid. Do you miss her old nose? I never met it. But as a Semite myself, I understand the issue. It's hard, man. You live every day with your life, with your life with a big nose. You slam fridge doors on it, regular doors on it. Try to get out of the car, you hit your nose. <laughs> Shut <the fuck> up. <laughs> uh, how did he first approach you? And did he know you were famous beforehand? So you do Okay, I suck. So I was real nervous because we were talking for like months. It felt like months. I don't know. It felt like my uh, my whole life has been building up to this, to me meeting this girl. I did not know. Uh, she was famous. I think the term you used at first was... Uh, oh, I no, said uh, internet hot girl. Yeah, uh, internet hot girl, sorry. And I was like... Big. <laughs> yeah, and I was like, whatever, that's whatever. That's what she does. So we meet at this bar, and I honestly was so nervous about the meeting, and I was like pretty fresh after a, a, another breakup, and I like had no game, honestly, like lost all of it. And <laughs> I walk into this bar, and, and I just... She tried to talk to me, and I didn't know what to say at all, so I just kissed her. And then she looked like flabbergasted and very... Upset. <laughs> <laughs> like, oh. And I was like, I'm so sorry. I got so nervous. I thought if I'll say anything now, I'll just ruin everything. So I just kind of, yeah. But she gave me a second chance. <laughs> and that's good. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you for that. Is she as into it with you as she is on camera? I guess you would know. I don't know. know. Are you? You can answer that. Yeah. And it's <laughs> different. I mean, maybe even more so because I have like uh, emotional attachment to it. I'm like uh, do you speak parler français? Actually, I don't speak uh, almost at all, but I can understand my fair share. Yeah, it's a problem. I can't talk about him with my yeah, family in front of him. Pretty funny. But when we try to talk about you in front of you, yeah, yeah. Um, what surprised you most about Arabelle? I mean, everything. Well, the fact that she was a porn star surprised me. I think how well put together everything was. Like her life was how like good she was at existing, like in an admirable way. Like I'm not that great at it. And definitely my ex wasn't and like people in general were my friends are generally more of a mess. And and Arabo is like a freaking impressive impressive young woman. Thanks, Dad. <laughs> You're welcome. Does Arabo snore? Very rarely and very softly. She's very rare and very soft. Yeah, I can generally tell that she's asleep. If she's pretending not to be asleep by her not moving at all, <laughs> she will just because Arabo sleeps without any movement. It's like a complete, just like she's out. But sometimes I'm still not too sure, so like I take pictures with my phone to see what's going on. <laughs> like, are you asleep? Because my hands numbed. <laughs> We're pretending to watch a movie, and I've been talking about this movie with you, and you just stop responding at some point. I mostly snore if I've been drinking alcohol. Which I don't do a whole ton. But. Yeah. No, yeah. Not, not a serious snore. Where are you from? I'm from Israel or occupied Palestine, whichever one. The Levant. The Levant. <laughs> yeah, the Levant. I'm from Tel Aviv. Do you satisfy her in bed? She claims I do, but I don't believe her. <laughs> <laughs> I think she keeps coming back for more with the hope that one day I will. <laughs> What's the best thing about dating Arabelle? The best thing about dating Arabelle is definitely dating Arabelle. And having her be a part of my life, sort of uh, initiated into her family in a very sweet way of both chosen family and real family. How often does he get his snow snatched from him? <laughs> the only way Arabelle can. <laughs> well, until I met Arabelle, I didn't even think I had a soul. <laughs> but then once she snatched it out with her tonsils, I realized something is missing now. So I had to um, eat her out for a while to try to get some of my soul back. And, you know, it's kind of like a cycle that never ends now of each other. Is, uh, we're just kind of playing dribble with my soul. It's like a snowballing. Yeah, snowballing. <laughs> soul balling. <laughs> soul balling. Yeah. But how often? Yeah, the annoying thing is, though, that I'm not good enough to steal her soul. So it's just my soul going to her, me trying to steal <laughs> it back out, and so on and so forth. <laughs> How often is <laughs> the question? How often what? To get, you know. Well, you know, never often enough. No such thing. Look, often enough, we couldn't even do this interview. <laughs> we would have started already. I'm hard to satisfy. I'm an unsatiated man. <laughs> Insatiable. Oh, wait, wait, that's actually a word, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, my God. I don't speak English, guys. I'm sorry. Yes, no, it's okay. Yeah. 
Um, Did you find it a bit intimidating to be with someone to be with someone so beautiful and sexual? Yes. Sure. What's something we wouldn't expect her to have as a hobby? What do your friends expect of you? I feel like I'm pretty open about my. Oh, you know what? Oh my god, dioramas. I was about to say. Yeah, that. dioramas. That's <laughs> no, nobody in the world can expect that from anyone. It's so weird. It's like being like, oh yeah, I build ships in bottles. <laughs> it's like so specific. <laughs> I know, it's been a minute. I should get back to that. Yeah, yeah. I really like making diarrhea. <laughs> oh, when did you make it official? I mean, we're not married. But oh my God. I guess, when did, we, um, when did we decide? So, we were like trying to play cool for a long while. I can't remember exactly when was the moment, but she slept at my house. And then in her sleep, she was like, I love you. And I was like, because oh, I also loved her. And also, because I've been holding my tongue from saying that for a while, every time we were making out and stuff. And then uh, I think the next day or a few days later at her house, I like let it slip, but I still didn't mean to, but I totally did. And then, yeah, I think that was official enough. And then at some point, oh yeah, and I called her buddy. And she got real, <laughs> really insulted. She's like, I don't do this shit with my buddies. And then uh, we're like, so wait, what are we in? That was it. <laughs> Actually, Friend. fun coming. Yeah. <laughs> hey, friendo. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> So I'm rocking an Arabelle shirt right now. Okay. Y'all should get some merch. You should. Um, oh, wait. I want to answer that one. Which one? Do you like double penetration? <laughs> I think that was for me. Some of these people did not understand. No, but you have like... to ask me these questions. Like, they're okay. for me because it's funny. You like double penetration? You know I do. Penetrate me, baby. <laughs> All right. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, any no list while dating? What's a no list? I don't know. I'm guessing things that you're not comfortable with me doing. Yeah, I guess whatever. no lying and cheating and stuff. I guess that goes yeah. both ways. Generally, yeah, that is the if thing. you have an agreement with a partner of any kind, try not to break that agreement. And if you do, come clean so that you can, uh, you know, continue being honest. Honesty. <laughs> How does it feel to be the l <laughs> luckiest man in the world and envy of myself and every dyke I know? Um, Ronald Reagan. <laughs> <laughs> Do y'all kiss after her shoots? Yeah, we kiss before, after, all the time, whenever we meet. <laughs> yeah, I give a shit. Uh, what's her favorite position? Doggy? Mm. I don't have a fave. Yeah, I don't know. Again, it's like one of those things. I like I like a lot of things. What are like your least what's your least favorite position? Reverse cowgirl. Mm, <laughs> well, that's okay, that's true, that's true. We found there's we a couple. Found, I don't like reverse cow <laughs> reverse cowgirl. Real life reverse cowgirl like Great. is different. Or like POV shot reverse cowgirl. Hot. Good. When I'm like on top of male talent and doing Doing this? It's that just shit a is hot. It's so <laughs> much work. I hate it. Yeah. Um, what is your routine for her after a shoot? I met his mom like right after that orgy. <laughs> what is the best date for a porn star? Have you ever swallowed your boyfriend's spit and piss? <laughs> 